Hey guys, it's Hot Wheels Clear here today showing you two of my custom controllers so far um, for Xbox 360. My first one I ever did was uh, a Tiger Stripes blue and green. As you can see, it's kind of cracked here. I actually had to redo the front. I screwed up and yeah, I had to redo it because put too much clear coat on and thought I could wash it off did not turn out so well. Tried drying it then. My, yeah, I tried using a paper towel at first, got all the fibers on it, turned out horrible. Resanded it down, ended up with that for the front. Still pretty nice. There's actually some cracks on the left side, your right. It actually, what I kind of like about it, is it actually only goes to the middle, so the um, left side actually only has cracks, so it almost looks intentional. Kind of like it, but hopefully I can do better next time because my next one is for my friend. It'll be silver for a base coat. Let it dry for a day. Then I'm going to put on my tiger stripes and then paint it gold. So it'll turn out pretty nice. I'm also getting some joysticks that are custom, like um, red, yellow, blah, blah, blah. That will have them for them. Nice. Everything works great. And my second controller, um, it's my blood splatter. Turned out really nice. Um, didn't paint these. I'll probably do that later, because these suckers take so much effort. Um, then for some reason I need to fix this. It, you can't really see it, but there's more or less a more of a gap over here than here. Really don't know why, but back side looks pretty nice. The battery pack is right here. I have it off because it's one of the rechargeable ones and it kind of it's kind of broke so I had to super glue it. Ha tried to get it a little bit better but here let me see if it ah, tight fit but pretty nice. Turned out really good. Um, Bottom here yeah, but next time, what I did is I took them all apart and laid them down like you usually would. But next time, when I do one for a friend, if he wants a blood splatter, I'm going to put it all together, put something inside of here. This won't be here when I do paint because that's with the motherboard. And I'll put something inside there and hang it with a string. That way I can twirl it around. That way there will be more or less more paint here and here stuff like that, so that way um, it looks nicer, but once I get my joysticks, these are turning red, the other controller, it'll be blue and green for joysticks, probably by, um, what you call them, um, ah, bullet buttons for, I'm going to do a Black Ops 2 one probably, uh, probably be some blood splatter, with some stencils of zombies, put them on there. Um, yeah. So that'll turn out pretty good. I'll probably end up even painting these. If you notice, you can actually see how different the white is. Because I painted the D-pad also. But look at the white. Sorry, I'm using a tablet, but see how different the white is from this? Because I actually painted this white even when it was a white controller, but yeah. Uh... Then I'm actually going to show you one of my limited edition controllers that I will not paint over. Uh, it's I, a dragon controller, I guess. I did not paint this. Th this was a limited edition. I got it for Christmas quite a few years ago. Um, I don't use it as much as I do anymore. I just use one of my black controllers. Um, pretty easier. Really, I just kind of want to keep this from getting damaged. Um, but my other, I'll paint one more of my controllers. I want to keep one just regular. But another thing I have to do with this, everything is kind of smooth, but with little bumps because of the paint. But back here, it's a little bit rougher than it should be. So I'll probably just clear coat this again, like cover the little spot up here. Then just clear coat the back again, or even tape these up. The triggers so that way they don't get hit like I said I'll do the triggers later um 
after this, um, go ahead, give me some requests on what I could do for some controllers. Really, all I can think of is blood splatter, tiger stripes. Trying to think of some other stuff to do. Because, like I said, these are only my first few controllers, but, um, I just use some simple paint. I have silver, gold, red, white, um, some green, yellow, and black. That's all I have so far, but if you request something where it needs a different color, I can probably go get it. Um, I actually buy some pretty good spray paint. It's usually 6 or $7 a thing, so, yeah. I clear coat everything, so go ahead, give me some requests if you need anything, and thanks for watching.